What is up guys? My name is Nick and welcome back to another Modern Warfare video. Today we're going to be looking at the AUG because this is a gun that a lot of people are telling me you got to play with it. It's a great weapon and all that kind of stuff and it's great for Warzone and I just didn't believe people and then I used the AUG and yeah, it's pretty damn good, all right? Like I used to, I'm a firm believer that the MP5 and the MP7 should be the SMGs to go to, but the AUG, dude, I used it. It's crazy. Use it, guys. I'm going to give you guys the best class setup for this weapon. What is up guys? Welcome back to the other video. Now I just want to say quickly before we get into this class setup because it's a really damn good class setup. But I just want to say man you guys have been killing it lately with the subscriptions and all that kind of stuff. All of you guys subscribing got like 10k in a week or less and I think that's actually mind blowing. That's insane. So I want to thank you guys for all the support recently and I also asked you guys to hit 3,000 likes on the last video. You all passed that like crazy. So thank you guys. Now if we could set, set another goal of 3,000 likes on this video right here. If you guys could hit that that would be absolutely amazing and I'll give you guys like I'll, I'll find out a class I'll find a class that's literally a two-shot class and I'll give it to you guys and stuff like that now let's get into this AUG class because this is a good one and I want to say it's really good for multiplayer and that's the most of the gameplay that you guys are gonna be seeing in the background but it's actually really good for Warzone as well like I used it in Warzone I didn't think it would be but there's a few attachments that you got to change for Warzone I'm gonna give you guys the whole entire class the perks the secondary which is the Renetti really damn good gun and all that kind of stuff so let's start off quickly here we're gonna go into the perks and we're just gonna talk about these fast so the first one is scavenger scavenger is definitely needed so you could always pick up bullets and all that kind of stuff if you're playing warzone switch it over to double time or eod whatever you feel comfortable with perk 2 definitely ghost you always want to run ghost it's it keeps you off the map when there's uavs it keeps you off the map when you're shooting in warzone but if you feel like running another primary weapon with the aug then you're gonna obviously have to run overkill in warzone or anything like that perk 3 tracker you could always find the enemies love it super easy to use after that you want to use the lethal c4 this helps you out a lot if you weaken the guy just pop a c4 over there blow it up whenever you feel like it and a lot of people ask me how do you blow up the c4 fast well that's actually pretty easy you just double tap square might be a on xbox and it blows it up you don't have to you don't have to press the thing or anything it literally blows it up in a split second and the last one is going to be the heartbeat sensor if you're playing warzone but if you're playing multiplayer stem shot so you guys could heal a lot faster every single time now let's get into the actual aug setup so this one is what i love a lot this aug setup is actually insane so what you want to run first is going to be the barrel 407 millimeter extended barrel this is really good because it gives you damage range it gives you bullet velocity and it gives you recoil control and it only takes away a little bit of ads speed and i do have to say this gun is not going to be that great for ads speed but this is good you get to shoot people further with that damage range you get that bullet velocity which is basically let's say a guy is standing right here you're standing here you shoot him your bullets usually go down a little bit they fall down and they might hit his legs if you're aiming at his chest if he's far enough but with bullet velocity if you're aiming at his chest it's going to hit exactly where you're aiming the further they actually get and stuff like that so definitely use that and then the recoil control the aug does have some weird recoil where the gun shoots up a bit you definitely want to throw this on just for that the next attachment we're going to skip the laser we're going to skip the optic i feel like the iron sight is very good so we don't need one but the next one is going to be the forge tack cqb comb and this only gives us ads speed and it takes away some aiming stability and the reason the real reason i like this is because this gun without this attachment right here the ads speed is kind of slow so we definitely want to run this just to get that ads speed up a little bit the under barrel is going to be the commando foregrip for that recoil stabilization and the aiming stability does take away some movement speed but you're running an smg so you don't have to worry about that too often the movement speed isn't something that you really have to worry about now the next one this one is really important this is the 5.56 nato 30 round mags ammunition now this is the one you want to run it gives you damage and it gives you range so the damage is perfect because it's up close mid range and long range the damage is going to be good and the range just means means that the gun is going to shoot further and deal more damage the further the enemy is so that's actually very good as well i think i explained that wrong it doesn't deal more damage the further they are but let's say normally someone's standing here and you're here this is going to do 30 damage while you shoot at him pow 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 but with this it might do like 34 damage instead which does equate to one bullet less to use which is really good to have and it does take away some recoil control but that's all good and i also want to say do not use these 60 round mag drums this it's good but it's it's not great it takes away mobility it takes away control it takes away ads speed in my opinion just reload the weapon it's a lot better to just do that and the last attachment for this class right here is going to be stippled grip tape which gives you ads speed 
and that's super important sprint to fire speed sprint to fire speed i always say it guys you definitely want to have good sprint to fire speed on your weapons you don't want to have a gun where you're running you're running and then it's time to shoot he takes an hour to pull it out no you want to have a gun where the second you stop running you're already firing that weapon it does take away some aiming stability but it's all good now like i said we're going to be changing a few attachments if you're going on to warzone and the first one is going to be we're going to take off the under barrel and change it for either the ranger foregrip so you could get that recoil control which does help out for the ranges or if you don't want that take it off completely go to the muzzle and throw on the monolithic suppressor this one is really good it gives you sound suppression and it gives you extra damage range it does take away aim walking steadiness and aiming down sight speed so that's kind of a negative but it's still a very good attachment to run after that there's another attachment that you could take off and that's the stock so you will lose ads if you take the stock out but you could throw on an optic so you guys could actually get shots at further ranges now i'm gonna say the op the optic that i love the best is the operator reflex optic the first one you unlock which is really good if you haven't leveled up this gun much you'll get it right away it's a very nice optic you see people clearly you could get those long shots and all that kind of stuff so go ahead and change those keep everything else the same i mean you could throw on the drum magazine if you want those extra bullets for warzone but personally i don't think it's worth it and uh, yeah i'm using this exact class in warzone the one that i made earlier but uh, it's better obviously if you do change the attachments now let's get on to the renetti because the renetti is cool and i do want to say i changed nothing this is the renetti that you get at tier 80 something i believe it is it might be 85 it might be 83 i'm not sure i forget what tier it is but this is the exact class you get there and in, in case you're not at that level yet in case you're not at that tier in the battle pass yet this is the exact class right here you get the opera or the the muzzle the desperado pro compensator this one's cool because it gives you recoil control but i don't like the fact that it takes away aiming stability and ads speed it takes away two things and only gives you recoil control so that's the only thing i don't like about this class but we're leaving it the same just because it is the actual weapon variant that you get the barrel is the mk3 burst mod this gives you a faster fire rate and it makes this gun a three round burst so i have to tell you guys this right now this gun without three round burst it's not that good it's still great but it's it's not that great if that makes any sense the three round burst really makes this weapon so definitely use that and i also want to say that this class right here it is the one that it's pre-made and stuff you don't change anything on it and it's such a good class i think this is probably the best class you can make for this weapon maybe taking off the muzzle and putting on a 5mw laser something makes it better but this is really good for a variant that's pre-made now the uh, trigger action you definitely want the lightweight trigger this gives you a faster fire rate so you guys can shoot faster and not wait in between bursts so without this it might go pop 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 yeah that, that's kind of slow but with this you can go brr, 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 and just shoot people so fast over and over and over again those sounds i was making is supposed to be bullets coming out of a weapon if that makes sense no it does take away some aiming stability but again who cares next off we got the ammunition the 27 round mags you want this you get more bullets in your magazine meaning you could kill more people without reloading really good to have right there and the last thing that this class comes with is the xrk pro grip this gives you recoil control which is really good when you have a weapon that's bursting because they could have a lot of recoil so throwing this on really does help and it does take away some aiming stability but it, it's kind of worth it so yeah guys that's it right there this is the aug with the renetti i find this class is a very good one to run here's all the attachments for the aug like i said that's it it's a really damn good class and here's all the attachments for the renetti pause the video take it use it it's it's amazing it's really good then we got the perks the lethal and the tactical i mean i love this class i'm gonna i'm gonna bite my own tongue and say you guys were right the aug is is absolutely amazing and i also want to say guys thank you for watching this video seriously thank you guys for subbing to the channel all you guys who are new around here and stuff it's it's crazy just watching the growth and whatnot i mean we're almost at 550,000, and we literally just hit 500,000 half a million so yeah thank you guys so much it's, it's actually crazy like i said at the beginning of the video if we could hit 3,000 likes that would be cool and if you made it this far you already know i'm gonna tell you guys to do something and it's hilarious when you do it anyways man last video we got a whole bunch of comments saying great class setup and it wasn't even a class setup video so guys let write down in the comments below on this video best tip video ever the best tips right anything you want that has to do with tips and uh, yeah we're just gonna mess with people who don't watch the video this long like i said guys thank you for watching my name is Nick. Subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Drop that like, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.